Hi, my name is Alessandro and I'm in charge of research and development by Fuchs Umwelttechnik. Fuchs Umwelttechnik is a well-established company in the area of the uh, air treatment and clean air technology, especially for indoor and industrial environments. Today I want to show you our new baby. <laughs> This is the new baby, which is based on the same system like every other uh, Fuchs Umwelttechnik device. That is the modular system. Every module has a specific aim according to the application that needs to be treated. Uh, in our case, we have the new module, which is the photocatalytic module, which is dedicated to the treatment of air from pollutants like uh, bacteria, viruses, VOCs, and even others. This is a photocatalytic lamp. There is a UV lamp inside, which is triggering the generation of free radicals from this outside mesh made of uh, titanium dioxide. The free radicals are free in the air and they interact with the particles in the air or the, mo the molecules they meet in the air, for example, to deactivate the viruses and the bacteria and the, uh, to change the molecular structures of the gases or to kill the others, for example. It's a consolidated technology and so you would say, and then what is the difference? The difference, like everywhere, is in the details. So this unit is made for volumes between 80 and 120 cubic meters, indoor rooms, and everything else is quite the same as the other ones. This one is the cousin of this. Uh, basically, this, the photocatalytic module in this case is a retrofit system because it can be applied to existing units. So, if a customer has already, uh, this is an, an MKF320 for example, he just can buy and fit this together with the kit, is supplied to, and can make it work. Alessandro, but do you have something also for homes or for like a very small office? Well, we are developing right now a desktop unit. Come and have a look. Tom. Ah, oh, before I show you the, the small one, there's another one I want to show you before. This is another prototype we're working on. The housing is made in, in a very strong cardboard, so 100% recyclable. And it's a very nice idea because this makes it much lighter than the other units. Even it works exactly the same. All the parts are completely reusable apart from the consumables. And inside you can fit exactly the same modules as all the other units. So photocut module, uh, HEPA filter, activated carbon filter, so everything can be exactly the same. Just lighter and 100% recycled. Is there any similarity with Formula One technology? Because I saw something upstairs. Well, apart from the flow, even in Formula One, the aim is always to reduce the weight. The, the more weight you use, the more energy you, you need to carry it around. So also in this case, it's going to be a nice, a nice opportunity. Can we look at the Formula One car? Yes, let's go. So Alessandro, does the device have any airflow similarities with the Formula One car? Well, there is a correlation, meaning that we, we use exactly the same knowledge to have the opposite result. Here we need the maximum efficiency or the maximum downforce. In, in our device, we want to have, in some cases, the maximum turbulence to have the optimum interaction between the uh, electrically charged parts and the particles. And so, for example, here, where there is the side plate to prevent the vortexes from the upper to lower side because of the, the pressure difference. In our devices, we play with the sequence of high and low pressure just to instigate this turbulence. It's just that. So you can see, this is a, another prototype. It's a desk unit that you can use, for example, in the working place. When you have two desks like this, one in front of each other, you can just put it in front, run it, and you have clean air on both sides, from the two, from the two sides. At the moment, it's made in wood, but it doesn't look too bad either. I like it. And it's not too loud, so I think everybody can work with it. 
The air quality is good. We have a HEPA filter, high quality HEPA filter and a ionizer inside and we create a, some more turbulence to have the optimum interaction and then the air comes out clean from the both sides. So I think it might be a, a good option for everybody in the working place. And also for like children, for home usage? For home usage, that could be another application. The idea is to place some more uh, brackets somewhere to what, so that you can place it also on top of some places or just in front of the TV or whatever the kitchen for example is good also for the others so also good for the children's room yeah. or for the toilets <laughs> thank you for watching and see you soon for the next news